Assalamu alaikum. My name is Nicole Queen, and I converted to Islam three years ago. I grew up in close to Louisiana, the border of Texas and Louisiana, and when I was eight years old, I moved south of Dallas and uh, grew up in a really small town there. Most people can't even find it on a map. We had about 48 kids in our graduating class, and so when we were growing up, we went to a fundamental Baptist church. So um, I kind of am very thankful to them because they built a really strong foundation of religion inside of me. And since their religions are so close, Islam and Christianity, um, it was like addicted I became to it. I started watching uh, things on YouTube about Islam, uh, videos from Yusuf Estes, you know, who is a, a convert to Islam, and girl to wear. And um, at the time, I thought of hijab as something. Um, something that you have to earn, like you have to study Islam for a long period of time before you can wear the hijab. Like that's what I thought. I thought I'm never going to get to that point. It's going to take me a long time. I started to get to closer with me. God and I started to have more respect for myself. Um, covering up was like God is saying, since you, since you have left this life that most people want to come to me, when it comes to keeping I'm each other with our religion. We, we have to keep each other on the, the right path. And I think that that's kind of one of the big purposes of, uh, of a Muslim married couple is that you keep each other on this direction um, whenever we're facing different challenges because you are going to face challenges living in, in America um, and then trying to live as a Muslim. So we help each other kind of resist the temptations that we face. Um, we remind each other of what we're trying to do and what we want for our children one day, inshallah. And I can look at him and tell at a moment when he is having a struggle, even if he doesn't say it, and he can do the same for me. And so it's just that ability to know and love each other that much that you, you want to see the other person as a successful Muslim. You know, you want him to love Islam as much as you do and you look at him and think like I want to feel as passionate as he does you know so we look at each other Islam, and push ourselves in the right apart direction. from other religions is the ease of it the simplicity and I know that may sound strange to some people um, because they would think Islam is not easy look at how difficult your life is you know with this religion and how challenging it is but the simplicity that I'm speaking of is when you need to make a decision and when you're going somewhere and when you're buying clothing to wear and when you when you walk out the door Islam helps you to make the decision to respect yourself I think that Islam takes you and your personality and it washes it off when I became a Muslim it was like somebody gave me a bath. It was like um, what Christians uh, follow is a baptism. I think that in Islam, like I said, it's kind of like you wake up from the nightmare that you were living would be and you get to wake up and when they want to learn about our faith um, is to just listen and look at how we live our lives like on a daily basis. So. Um, I wouldn't talk about the differences and I wouldn't focus on, well, you believe this and you're wrong and this is the right way and I, I don't talk like that about Islam. When I talk to people, I like to show them um, the simplicity of it. I like to tell people all of the things that are so similar to what they're already believing in their lives and show them how the things that they face and the challenges that you face in life um, there are answers for everything, you know, and there are guidances for everything to make it easy on yourself and to help you to make the right decision about common things that we have to do in life, about getting married, about how to treat your family, about what you do for a living, uh, raising your, your children, you know, everything. There is a guidance in this faith to help you to be the best person that you can be in whatever you do. If it's your career, if it's how you are with your friends, if it's the things that you do for fun, the way that you socialize, everything about your life, um, this faith has an answer for it and able to give you the, the chance to be the best that you can and to do the best with your life and to make the most of it. 
and to live for a greater purpose. One of the biggest messages that people don't really notice and that isn't projected is that it is simple answers to your life's problems.